Alright, hey everyone, hope you're doing well. Uh, hopefully my mic is working. Yeah, so, yeah, I just had a little bit of an audio issue. Uh, I think it's fixed. But yeah, today we're playing uh, Later Alligator. It's a nice, a very cute uh, point-and-click game. And, well... Uh, let me see... Let me read you the blurb here. Uh, later Alligator tells the story of Pat the Alligator, a mostly harmless and probably innocent reptile at the center of a conspiracy that could bring down the biggest, scariest family in Alligator, New York City. His own. Uh, explore the city, meet the family, and try to save Pat before the clock runs out. Uh, so it's mainly going to be point and click. It has really, really great animations. And I think there's mini games in there. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be a fun one, but let's see. All right, let me get this started. Yeah, this game came out, I wanna say, a week, two weeks ago. And it looked just really cool, so I wanted to check it out, but, uh, midterms kind of came in the way, but, uh, now that I'm done with them, I can finally play this. <sighs> it's working fine? Alright. Uh, you're not playing Where's My Water? I... sorry, I don't think I checked that out yet. Let me see. <laughs> Where's my water? Wait. <laughs> the iPhone game? The old one? Oh, man. Uh, I had an exam today, so I am feeling a little bit tired. I <laughs> got your fishy dreams. Damn. Yeah. Uh, so yeah. Welcome to Later Alligator. Uh, let me see. Oh, weird. Apply. I thought it was gonna give us the option of a new game. I only opened it, so it should be fine, right? Yeah, the animation in this is pretty great. Alright, let's get started. N no company, p please. Thank you. <laughs> oh, he's so... he's so timid. Uh... <laughs> uh, um, no hablo ingles. No hablo espanol. No hablos at all. Not even one hablo. Let's see here. Cute. Uh, this is a little loud. There we go. That should be better. Uh, hey, I'm trying to lay low here, so can you maybe move on, please? Uh, okay. Okay. You got me. I'll come clean. <laughs> I'm sorry for being so rude before. I'm just a little on edge. Normally, I wouldn't tell anyone this, but you've got such soulful eyes. I can totally see the entirety of... So I feel safe with you, stranger. <laughs> I love this guy. You see, usually I love coming to John Johnny's on my birthday like this. Staying in the hotel, floating in the pool. Eating two bagels at the Continental Pretend... <laughs> Got content Jesus. Continental breakfast, eating two soaps in the complimentary bath basket. But this year, I've got a problem. A real big problem. A real, real big uh-oh problem. The thing is, I'm pretty sure the family is finally trying to rub me out for squealing. I didn't mean to squeal. Honest, I just see a pair of earnest eyes and the secrets just start flowing out my snoop. <laughs> see? I'm doing it right now. Oh no. 
Oh god, what's the... Uh, what's the big bad secret? Uh, let me change this for a second. There we go. Oh, cheese and crackers. What am I gonna do? I don't want to be rubbed out. Tutan Tony even told me I have to meet him upstairs here at 8 for sharp for the event. They think I don't know, but I heard him talking to Big Mama on the phone. The whole family is gonna come to really show me how it's done. What am I gonna do? I don't want to sleep with the fishes. I have a shellfish allergy, and my asthma acts up when I get too waterlogged. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, he's in trouble with the Mafia? Oh, kid. Wait a sec. You're interested in me, right? You wanted to sit with me for breakfast and everything. Do you think you could help me? Since we're such great pals, you could go out and talk to my family around Alligator New York City. Find out information about the event and report back to me. Yes, this is a great idea. Together, maybe we can collect enough info to s save me. You want to save me, right? Right? Great. <laughs> I'll text you if I need any help. <laughs> How about... Wait, what? Uh, what do you say? How oh, you do? Great. I'll text a little before 10 a.m. since it can take 15 minutes or so to get back here on the trolley. Kind of skipped a little for me. So make sure you check your watch a bunch. Okay, he told me to check my watch, I guess. If you happen to get stuck doing some weird game-like activities while investigating, it could take time. Time I don't have. Because I'm going to have a murder done on me. Oh no. <laughs> I'm okay. Think of the beach pad. Remember what Dr. Doublesnoot told you. Oh. <laughs> uh, anyways. Dr. Doublesnoot. Uh, thank you so much for helping an out an alligator like me. I really feel better just looking at your super kind invisible face. <laughs> and be careful out there. The last thing we need is two people sleeping with the fishes. We need to find a double bed in this economy. See you later, friend. Stay safe. Alright, see you later, alligator. We're gonna save Pat. If we can. <laughs> It looks like he's in big trouble. Uh, let's talk to this goofy looking waiter over here. Hello, esteemed guest. If you're looking to leave the restaurant, you'll have to use the exit arrow up there in the corner screen. Okay. We provide all our patrons with an exit arrow and complimentary pillow mints. All how fancy. Feel free to use both outside of our fine establishment to exit and munch as you wish. Just don't mix the two up, since that arrow is vintage. And known to contain harmful materials such as lead paint, asbestos, and the combination of rat poisons and cilantro. Please feel free to visit us here again at John Johnny's, and have a Johnny of a day. <laughs> Cute. Alright, oh, what a goofy little dude. This is a nice place, I could stay here. They got a... I want to say a cappuccino machine. Alright, let's get out of here. <laughs> Capital of Alligator, New York State. Alright. Uh, we got John Johnny's Restaurant and Cafe. This way, click and drag up and down. Ooh. Oh, okay. We can see everything. How nice. What's this guy doing here? He looks like, uh... Looks like a totally legit guy. Hey, Bob, you got a minute? Or... Uh, okay. Perhaps three minutes? I ain't above asking for five. I thought my game crashed on me. That would not have been good. <laughs> I'm just having all the technical difficulties today. I saw you walking out of John Johnny's over there, and I says to myself, Mickey, you gotta talk to that mysterious stranger. My vision in pinstripes stays. I ain't trying to fluff you up or nothing, but you look like an alligator of exceptional taste. 
as well as one who might like to dabble in high stakes games of chance and intrigue, if you feel me. No, don't actually feel me, I got a skin condition. <laughs> they call me slick for a reason, and according to my doc, it ain't going away unless I start using that topical cream at night. Gross! But I ain't gonna listen to some jab jabroni with a smarty certificate, you know what I'm saying? All my smarts come from the streets, which is also where I got this skin condition <laughs> and my impolite lower back tattoo. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I like how it just says, whom? Name's Mickey, but everyone calls me the old king of cards. Well, that one guy did before he yelled at a fence to stop stealing his email passwords. <laughs> then his pants fell down. Then he fell down into an open manhole. But I have it on good authority from the paramedics that he only called he ca only called three or five people, other people that so uh, bada bean. <laughs> oh, I love this. <laughs> the old card king at your service. Oh. <laughs> oh man, I I just love these guys. Are you talking about Pat the alligator? Yeah, I know that dude pretty well. He's my second cousin. Is everyone here part of his family? At one time we was kids, us guys got... Uh, his little animations. He got locked out at a CCD after recess and missed juice and cookie time. We only had one granola bar between us and the good old Pat gave me the bigger half. I'll always... Remember that. No. I ain't crying. I just spit in my own eyes as display of my street toughness. Patoo. Patoo. <laughs> uh, and the event? Oh, how's he in trouble? Oh, you know about the event, eh? Well, looky here, Bob. It's a real secret affair, you dig? Ain't nobody supposed to be going and telling Pat about it. My lips are sealed, just like they're sealed when I wake up after a night of nose-only breathing. <laughs> oh no, okay. Uh, yeah, I'm sure Pat's in big trouble. Maybe though, just maybe. If you play a little game with Mickey here, my lips might loosen up. You think you can keep an eye on this flurry of fingies and find the queen? Oh god, okay, stay, keep an eye on the cards. Seems reasonable. Let's do it. He's running a street scam. Uh, keep an eye on the queen and pick the correct card to fool his plans. Oh, it's a scam. Are we gonna get the right card? Let's see. Alright, get your peepers peeled because these hands are about to become a hurricane. See here? Keep your eyes on the lady. Where's she gonna go? Where's she gonna go? <laughs> no! Oh no! <laughs> no! Well, I guess we'll never know who won. Who knows which way the wind blows or some junk. <laughs> Hell yeah, we won. <laughs> you got a family member badge. Oh, jeez. Oh, that was the cutest thing ever. <laughs> Okay. Anyways, about the event. Well, you ain't heard it from me, but I hear it's gonna be a real affair to remember. The whole family's been talking about it for months. That's really gonna get us, if you know what I'm saying. Anyways, thanks for playing. Let me know if you need any of my city smarts while you're out there, rookie. Try not to lick any trolley handrails if you can help it. <laughs> Those dermatology co are a real kick of the alligator pants, you feel me? Oh! Ah, <laughs> oh, cute. 
the trolley ain't here yet, so why don't you go check out the arcade? Mickey got banned for his slick fingers gumming up the machines and causing an epidermis epidemic. Does everyone have a skin condition here? Oh. Oh, no. That ain't mean you gotta suffer the same fate. Oh! <laughs> okay. Alright, uh, well, I guess we can check out some other things. Let's look at the watch. 8.30, huh? Looks, guess we don't have much time to save Pat. Uh, but let's see. Oh, I can go in the arcade. That's the arcade. There we go. Uh, um, hello. Is this by chance your first time in Alligator, New York City? I mean, in the city. City, not, um, Alligator Long Island or something. Uh, it is. Who's this? I thought so. Oh, um, you don't know me. I'm sorry if that's weird. I just thought if you'd like, I could text you some tips. The city is really big and has a lot of colorful secrets that I wouldn't want you to miss on your first visit. Is it okay if I help you out from time to time? That's, that's fine with me. Sure. Ah, great. I'll be sure to text you again soon. Don't forget to enjoy yourself. Alright, that's a little shady, but I don't know. I don't know what goes on in Alligator, New York City. We got Street Kiter 2. <laughs> My favorite. Uh, Vampire Punter D. And Train. <laughs> Alright. Joni. Hey there, you up for a real challenge? I haven't seen you here before, stranger. Alligator New York City is a big place, but we tend to have regulars, you know? Like Rocco and Bonnie over there. Those two are here every day, but you, I'd remember such a visible face like yours. <sighs> Look at me being a real jerk. I don't mean to be giving you a hard time or nothing. I've just been a little frazzled since last night. I had a dream I was a ski ball and some sticky-fingered kid kept throwing me into the ten-point hole. Go for the fifty, dingus, I tried to yell, but being a ball and all, the ding-dong couldn't hear me. I woke up in a cold sweat in my kitchen, systematically throwing individual oranges from the window into my neighbor's terrarium. The vitamin C would have helped me shake it off, but all I had for breakfast was black coffee and half a can of leftover candy cigarettes. I love your your winged eyeliner. Uh, whom? Who are you? The name's Joni, or Baloney. If you're my fourth grade bully, come back to fight me. <laughs> you're not right. Oh, she's got big lesbian energy. Sam. Anyway, I work here at Adelaide's Arcade. Sweeping floors and keeping all the games running smooth as a baby's ball me behind. I used to work as a greaser in a shop downtown, but I left closer to my gaming hobby. They let me keep the leather jacket, though. <laughs> and the company hairstyle. <laughs> Cute, okay. Uh, Pat? Mm, Pat's my cousin, and also the most genuine doof I know, so you better be nice to him, you hear? I wouldn't want to have to pop you one. I'm told I got a mean left hook, and a moderately insulting right hook, <laughs> and a kick that could benefit from some anger management courses. I tried to sign it up for some calming hot yoga at the <laughs> YACA, but it didn't go over so well. You ever get kicked by your own leg? It ain't great, bud. <sighs> it ain't great. Uh, why do I love everyone in this city? Look, I know you're here spying for Pat for whatever reason, and that's fine. I can't tell you family secrets, you feel me? To give up info that hot, you'd have to really impress me. Alright. Can I play you in some Vampire Punter D? So what do you think? Can you roll the ball, old-timer? I'm talking pinball. The old Penny B, as I like to call it. Against the advice of both my friends, family, and supportive therapist I see on Thursdays. I got the highest score on Lizard Wizard here, eight months run. 
but I'm always looking for a real pinhead to pin my skills against. So what do you say? Care to take on a pinball lizard like me? <sighs> I didn't make to, mean to make a joke. I take this very seriously. <laughs> All right, let's play the old Pinny B. Uh, I don't know if we probably won't have time to play all of them, right? We are on a, a strict time limit here, maybe? Mm. I'm sure we'll have time to play all of them. Why wouldn't it let us play all the games? Alright. Alright, classic pinball. Just like uh, Sonic Adventure pinball. Let's do it. Oh man, that's a weird perspective. Uh, let's try this. <laughs> oh god. No. No. Oh man. I'm not really good at pinball. I can't tilt this shit. <laughs> uh, please give me a high score. No. <laughs> the young Al. Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, we can retry for a time delay. Uh, a time penalty. <laughs> I'm not really good at pinball. Who is? Young Alligator Christian Association. <laughs> ah, fuck it. We'll just try to play as much as we can. Ah, oh, no! Alright, that, that wasn't so bad. I don't know if she said we needed a high score or something. No. Let's try that again. <laughs> Only pinball experience I ever had was playing uh, Space Pinball on Windows XP. And Sonic Adventure. Those were the days. No. Eh. Yeah. Is that good enough? Hell yeah! <laughs> uh, the old penny bees get ain't no match for me. Oh jeez! <laughs> hey, it's been a long time since I seen moves like that in front of the lizard wizards here. You had that ball hitting all the duwats and who's it so fast I could barely keep up. It's been a real honor to hang out with another student of the pinball arts. <laughs> I got a puzzle piece. Oh, jeez. 
about the event. Now, this might just be a rumor, but word on the street, there's gonna be some sick games there. Not pinball per se, but you know, you take what you can get. Anyways, that's all I can really say. I better get back on the grind trying to beat my last high score. Thanks for showing me your supple wrist, Pinhead. Catch you later. <laughs> Alright. Sonic XD Pinball. Oh, man. In the casino zone? Oh, that took up so much of my time. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I'm gonna take a really quick break, and I'll be right back. So, yeah. Uh, I gotta take the dog out and yeah, get something to drink. See you in a bit. All right, I'm back. Uh, let's meet some of the other gators in this uh, this joint. Got this sneaky looking guy. 
Oh, why do we always have got to come here? This place is a dump. You didn't have to come, Rocco. No way. The only thing worse than being in a dump is not being invited to the dump to begin with. Like you're too trashy for the other trash, which is unnervingly close to an entry from my dream journal last week. <laughs> All right, Bonnie and Rocco. Uh, so who's this little gator hiding from us? Um, my mom is always on my case like, Artie, go outside and talk to the other alligators. Or Artie, stop hiding behind various types of curtains in and outside our home. <laughs> Alright, cute. <laughs> Sweet Geraldine. Aw, oh, what a cutie. Uh, hey up there. Long arms. You got a sec? Nice suit. Uh, what's a fancy reptile like you doing at the back of the arcade? Aww. Aww. I like, I like your little handbag. Your little... little strawberry bag. I know what you're after. That's right, I've got you pegged just by looking at ya. Uh? You want cold, hard... plush. Well, you found the right alligator. And I've got a job that'll pay for both of our retirements and poorly made stuffies. <laughs> you might see a humble claw machine, but this is a vault, and we're gonna break in. What the? <laughs> Alright, if you want to commit crimes, let's do it. But we can't just walk in. No, there's countermeasures. Sometimes Norma the security guard comes by and says I'm not allowed to put my clawing chair into the aisle. Without the boost, I'm not tall enough to work the claw. She says it's a fire hazard, but most of the machines in here are. You see behind there? That's one ailing power strip juicing up every one of these babies. Wrong, one wrong move and pinball and boom! This place lights up like my chemistry teacher's hair when I turned that Bunsen burner too high. Oh no. Uh... <laughs> I love the... I love you. I love you, kid. Who are you? Me, I'm known around these parts as Sweet Geraldine, criminal mastermind of the claw machine. You haven't heard of me? Honestly, I'm not surprised. I leave no fingerprints, and Johnny Law doesn't have a clue. Or Johnny Boyer, from my geography class. <laughs> At least that's what he said when I asked him to the spring fling. Oh no! <laughs> oh, poor Geraldine. Uh, you know Pat, right? Pat is a patsy, but not my patsy, that's for sure. He's related to some of my dad's friends. Uh, one time, at dad's show, Pat pulled the fire alarm because he thought someone was trying to set him on fire. It turns out he just had a warm pizza pizza in his pocket. <laughs> No one could find them for almost an hour until the firefighters pulled him out of the concert hall's crawl space. He was covered in spiders and had eaten the pizza, but was otherwise unharmed, physically anyway. That guy's pretty weird. <laughs> oh yeah. I'd love to tell you about the event, I really would, but this is our first time on the job together, Mac. You haven't yet earned my unbridled trust. Oh, all right, we gotta earn your trust. Maybe we could come to a mutually beneficial arrangement. The claw machine? It's a two-man operation. I need someone who's not gonna sell me down the river for additional prizes when Plush comes to serve. You feel me? <laughs> uh, what do you say, old-timer? One last claw machine score. The big one. All right, I grab the prizes and she advises. <laughs> We're going to class school. Let's do it. Okay. Uh, left and right, and then center button. Got it. <laughs> Here she is, the big quesadilla, the mother load. Inside this vault is a treasure trove of prizes. I've had my eye on a couple of choice goods, but I need an accomplice with nerves of steel and hands of steel. A uh, tall patsy like you can push the buttons and see the prices. <laughs> so what do you say? Let's get some cute loots for cute snoots. <laughs> uh, 
first you should warm up your tricky digits. All right, I got my jazz jazz hands. Uh, grab me any prize that catches your eye. Go on, old timer. Show me what you got. Okay. I thought we were following ins your instructions, huh? Uh. I don't know. I like this octopus guy. Come on. <sighs> Ooh. Oh, that's not what I wanted, but I mean, good enough, right? My dad says I'm not supposed to have too much candy because I get hyperactive and prone to fits of father pinching. <laughs> oh no. But I think he just likes keeping it all for himself. You've got some chops. I respect that. But now the real job begins. How will you react when the pressure's on? This time, you follow my lead. Ooh, big diamond. That's a beauty. Give me that humongous gem. Uh, I'll try. Uh, this is probably harder than it looks. All claw games are, aren't they? Well, at least we have unlimited time, right? Come on. Hell yeah. You got one. What is it? They say diamonds are a girl's best friend. So I'm looking forward to getting deep into some alligator settlers of Catan with this baby. <laughs> You're really good at this, but it's finally time for the big score. I can see it in your eyes. You're ready to get the ultimate prize. Get me the doll from the best, most awesome video game franchise of all time. Final Frenzy. <laughs> He's the dreamy one with the spiky hair. This is it, the big one. Oh God. Uh, uh, which one is that? Maybe this guy? I was thinking it was Cloud. No! Uh, oh, okay. Did you get it? The ultimate prize? Oh, MGs! I can't believe you got the dreamiest anime Game Boy from Final Friend City. Claude Stripes. <laughs> Claude, his hair is almost as prickly as his social interactions with women. <laughs> this is exactly what I wanted. Thank you so much for helping me. Oh, you're welcome, kid. Yeah. Did we get a family uh, sticker or something? I can't believe it. The big score. And thanks to you, we had a clean getaway. We got a badge. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, man, you're just the cutest. I'll tell you what you need to know. The event is a secret. I'm a gator, not a rat. That's right, a classic double cross. <laughs> That's the calling card of Sweet Geraldine, Master Criminal. Oh, oh, dang it. oh hey, bad. <laughs> Hey, it's me, Pat. The alligator? The one with the hat? Hello, Pat. It's almost ten, can you come back? Someone came over to my table and threatened me. Oh, shit. Well, they gave me a coupon and told me to have a nice day. <laughs> but that could mean anything. <laughs> uh, one free tomato soup. Best in Alligator, New York City. Oh uh, no, I wonder what that could mean. Uh, here's a coupon I got last week. If you come back, I'll give it to you. No questions asked. I'm on my way. Oh man. Oh fuck. Half thinking this event is a birthday party for Pat. Uh, see, that was my first, first uh, guess. But you know. They could always, they could always be murdering him. Ah, don't bop me. Uh, oh, it's just you, my new friend. Sorry, I saw your shadow over me. I thought some kind of restaurant assassin was descending from the rafters to take me out. I know there's no rafters here, but assassins are tricky. They can improvise. 
Didn't you have to have dare when you were in elementary school? Dare. You know, dare, dude. Assassins really exist. At least I think that's the acronym. <laughs> I was absent a lot due to my nut allergy. <laughs> oh, no. I don't think we had dare in our school. It was a tough time for Pat at Willie's Peanut Butter Factory <laughs> Elementary School. Oh no. I'm so sorry, Pat. Anyway, did you find out anything from the family? God, the writing in this is, uh, grade A. <sighs> well, well, yeah, I know they sound nice, but <laughs> they might be just fluffing you up. You know, buttering your bread roll to throw you off the trail. Sorry, I've actually just been sitting here mainlining complimentary bread rolls the whole time you were gone. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe we should go to my hotel room. I think I'd feel a little safer there. And less Logie with bread. Let's go. Alright, let's follow him. Lead the way, Pat. <laughs> yeah, alligator cloud strife. She really does that... <sighs> that two-time and... Two-time and criminal. Oh, it's a minigame. Uh, my safe place... Find the code to Pat's abode. <laughs> Cute. Let's do it. Uh, help Pat to into his hotel room. Help Pat with his outdated website. <laughs> uh, we'll help Pat remember his room code. Aw, oh, man. Okay. I guess he forgot. Uh, thanks for protecting me. It really helps to have someone walk me into my room. The wallpaper in here is a little intense. Kind of makes me feel like something is staring at me. <sighs> what am I going to do? My heart can't take ten more hours of waiting. What's the event? What did I screw the beans on? Cheese and crackers. <laughs> Since I was so worried about getting super murdered today... I did the smart thing and got a special lock from my hotel room door. Just a little something I picked up at the hardware store. I was worried I'd get so nervous that I'd forget the lock's passcode, so I saved it on my website, www.alligator.fun. I'm so glad I planned ahead. <laughs> okay. Wait, isn't your website outdated? Uh, what are we doing here? Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. Uh, th that might be a little overkill. Oh, here we are. This is for sure my room. You can tell by the unobtrusive lock I installed. Can you go to my website and grab the code so we can unlock it? That's www.alligator.fun. I really want to go inside and see if there are any more of those free mints left. <laughs> Am I actually going to go to the website? Okay. www.alligator.fun Ooh. <laughs> okay. Uh, wow. <laughs> it's like a GeoCities website. Oh man, how do I show you guys? Uh... Here, you know what? Yeah, just click the link. I'm sorry. I wouldn't know how to open my browser without, you know, taking a lot of time to do it. Uh, so, what, we got a page. It says, this is Bat's homepage, generated by Geoscalies. Uh, cute. We got a nice marble texture background. Uh, we got about me. And we got don't click. Pat only. <sighs> I clicked about me and it says about me. I'm Pat. And it's just a selfie of him. Cute. Uh, don't click. Alright. Tells us the password. If you're not Pat, you're breaking the law. 
This has been reported to the computer police. And the password is... Uh, how do I type this in? Hello? Nine... One... Six... One... Nine. You did it! Thank you so much! <laughs> oh, that's... That's most excellent. Ah! Uh, I, I can't close it. What's going on? Help! You gotta help me! I don't even like pink! Uh... Uh... 91619? Oh, it worked. Okay. Wait, was that acid? Oh my gosh. <sighs> Hello? My word. This is quite the mess. Who are you two and why have you opened my door? Uh, who am I? I'm Pat and this is my hotel room. I installed this lock because my family is trying to rub me out. <laughs> Alright, Tim. But this is my door where I've installed a lock because my family is trying to rub me out. But if that's true and my password still worked... Uh, is your... Wait, is your lock code 91619? <laughs> it's a little dance. Is your lock code 91619? We have the same code. Oh, they're so cute. And our families are both trying to kill us. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh, so long, stranger. Perhaps in another life we would have been total best friends. Like ships in the night, Mr. Pat. Anyway, don't tell anyone what you've seen here. Or I'll come for you. Endlessly. His fucking face. That sure was a string of unlikely coincidences, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, man. I hope that guy's room is okay. That stuff smells like bromine? Bromine? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, where's your room, Pat? Ah, there it is. Wait a minute, that doesn't look anything like the other room. Aha! This is my actual room. They're so similar, no wonder I mixed them up. <laughs> alright, alright. Uh, 91619. Thanks. I never would have remembered that on my own. Come on in. <laughs> yeah. We did it. Phew. I'm so glad we made it inside. Now I can really try to relax a little. Sorry to distract you from the investigation. I'll text you again when it gets closer to 4 p.m., so don't forget to check your watch. You know, in case you get distracted doing a collection of menial tasks formatted in an enjoyable manner. Something like that. Oh, jeez. Bye for now. Alright, Pat, you have fun now. Don't get murdered. Oh, who is this? Who is this little gator here? Charlene. There's something so nice about just sitting by yourself in a restaurant with a good book. Alright. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Who is that shady looking alligator? Do you see that waiter? My girlfriend is coming to pick me up after work. I'm so nervous. Oh, cute. Oh, we found a puzzle piece. Oh, hello. I can't click that guy. Definitely something shady going on. Let's get out of here. Hey, Bob. You're just in time. The trolley got here a minute ago. Why don't you just go check out the city? Bring Mickey a hot dog, maybe, or some protective handwear. I'm gross. Oh. 
Alright. Oh, it looks like there's a few folks we can talk to here. Let's chat this lady up. Lovely Maria. Oh dear. I think I may have left my scrapbooking scissors at home on accident. Oh, I found my scissors. It must have been your approach that gave me good luck, stranger. <laughs> I've been trying to get outside the home more since I had the baby. Nana's watching her today, so here I am, out in the world. Amy's been repeating the same announcement every 10 minutes? That's not supposed to happen. What the? Uh. Oh, yikes. Uh. Alright. Sorry about that. I'll just put Amy to sleep. Pseudo hall. Yeah, sorry about that. I don't know what's going on. I haven't changed anything in the code. Uh, the only thing I can think about is YouTube's API has changed because some weird stuff has been going on uh, with Amy and YouTube. So that sounds like a YouTube thing. Yeah, I just... Uh, Amy's just... Uh, she's just sleeping with the fishes now. Thank you, sir. It's a little nerve-wracking to be away from the nursery after all those months, to be honest. I really love everyone's animations. It's all so cute. <laughs> I already miss all the new baby smells. Well, not all the smells. We all know more things come out of babies than just the sweet fragrance of their cute little heads. <laughs> well, even that stuff is a little cute. <laughs> Uh... <laughs> What's up, confused face? Hello. How are you doing today? I'd like to join in. And my spagoogie man. Welcome. Thanks for stopping by. Hope you guys are doing well. Uh, whom? I'm Maria. It's wonderful to meet you. I was headed to the local YACA before I ran into you. I'm taking a class there today on scrapbooking, but I'm a little early. I meant to wait here in the lovely weather until the class on mom yoga and self-defense ends. Eat, pray, shove. <laughs> Alright, you know Pat? Oh, do you mean my son, Pat? Oh, I'm just so proud of him. Your son? <laughs> it's his birthday today, did you know? <laughs> I had a hunch. He's so funny with how he treats himself to a hotel stay every year of the day. He just loves that continental breakfast. And those free tiny soaps. I do get concerned he eats too many of those, however. Sud shouldn't be coming out of the snoot of a boy that age. <laughs> uh, do you know anything about the event? Uh, the event is actually why I'm taking this class today. Uh-huh. Actually... Since you're one of Pat's friends, maybe you could help a mom out. You see, I'm trying to put together out a family tree to bring tonight uh, as a surprise, but I don't have everyone's pictures. It's so hard for all of us to get together in one place these days. I don't think anyone would like me to use their photos from the early 2000s. We all made some questionable wardrobe decisions back then. But we sure did. Since you're already going around town, would you mind snapping some pictures of the family? Any you get and bring back, I'll put in the family tree. Maybe if you get them all, something good will happen. Oh, I see you already have one there. Would you like me to put it in? Here, you can have mine as well. Don't want anyone feeling lonely. Aw, oh, it's the family member badges. Cute. Let's see how much you've learned so far. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Family history mystery. Collect the fam to uncover the scam. Uh, click and drag. I got a collection. <laughs> okay. Uh, do we have to guess or what? Hmm. I'm 
I'm gonna guess this is Pat. Yeah. This must be Pat, right? Right? Oh, uh, come on. Oh! Wait, what? Mm hmm here. Huh? Nah. Nah. Maybe here? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Oh, okay. Oh. I guess it's not Pat over here then. Sweet Geraldine. Tween occupation mod on an age appropriate anime forum. Oh, cute. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, now, where can we put mom? It, it just makes sense for her to be there. Huh? We're here? We're here? That doesn't make sense. Huh? 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 Oh, oh. What's this? No? Mm. Mm. Pat? Alright, if we find Pat, we'll find uh, We'll find where Mom goes. It's so weird to me. I really thought Pat would be there. Yeah. It's gotta be one of these, right? <gasps> oh, it's backwards. Oh. Oh, it's upside down. I thought it was like a family tree that... Okay. I'm just a big dummy. So mom goes here. We're here. There we go. And one of these is Pat's cousin, so... Brother, sisters... Mom, Dad. It's gotta be one of these, right? Hmm. Aha! Wait, are you Pat's cousin? Yeah, you are. Nice. Slick Mickey. 18 annoying people. <laughs> uh, love me, Maria. She's 48, and she's the church rummage sale cashier. And Joni, we know her. She's a pinball wizard at 23. Cute. Thanks again, dear. Come back anytime. All right. Now, I guess that helps out in the mystery a little bit. <laughs> it's Pat's birthday. All right, let's talk to this, this skater here. Daryl. You have read at John Johnny's here. The food's alright, but that bottomless chowder bowl was a disaster. I picked that thing up and bam, chowder pants for the rest of the day. Uh, oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy. Alright, can we take the trolley? Oh, we, oh, I see. Oh, who's this guy? <laughs> Fifth William the Fourth. Oh, boy. That sign flower looks as tasty as ever. I come here most days to stare at her, but I usually leave when someone calls the alligator police so I slip and fall down in a rather overwrought fashion. <laughs> Ooh, we got a puzzle piece. Oh, a very sexy sign there. All right, let's take the trolley. Ooh, all right, we can take the, take the trolley to Fun District. Alligator Memorial Park, the unsavory part of town, or downtown. Hmm. I want to go to... <laughs> Let's go to Alligator Memorial Park. Start off small, eh? Ah. Who are these two characters? <laughs> they look 
quite funky. Making my way downtown. Hey, Amber. It's, it's you. Had no class. Well, I'm glad you could join in. How are you today? Hope you're doing well. Please don't click and drag on the grass. I'll do it. Sorry about that. Uh, who's this beefy gator? <laughs> Gentle Lorenza. Broline, 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 Broline? Oh, <laughs> Broline. I'm begging you, dude. Please give me a hand. 901? 902? 903? Phew. Well, that's the highest number I know, so I guess that's enough. Huh? Oh. Sorry, Brosephine. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, I'm using that. <laughs> I didn't see that. Shrouded in total shadow by the monolith of my beefy bod. You're not gonna start hitting me with a bone like the last one, are you? Sigh. Don't worry. It happens to me all the time. <laughs> oh man, who are you? Me? People call me Lorenzo on account of it being my name. I work downtown at the Brodega Fitness Center in Mini Mart. Being inspirational, aspirational, and non-recreational. I'm very serious about my job, Roseanne. <laughs> oh, Roseanne. Alright. Pat. Bro. That's my for real big bro. Well, not big big. He's kind of mild to medium sized bro as far as alligator brothers go. He's like the mid sized sedan of brothers. Me? Well, I'm like the sport utility vehicles brothers. Uh, assertively large, but a little empty feeling inside. Oh no. Oh no. I love this. I love you, Lorenzo. Uh, let's see. Uh, Vent, you mean tonight? Hold on, gotta take the doggo out. Alright, sorry about that. So I'm gonna end up after a gym. You got that right, bro, Anna. <laughs> uh, event, you mean tonight? Uh, to tell you the truth, bro, that I was sworn to secrecy. On my honor, over a bottle of white protein and a stack of those muscle magazines I keep hidden under my bed. <laughs> My strong jaw is strongly closed. <sighs> Though, despite my problem-free, GMO-free lifestyle, I am having a muscle tissue issue I could have, uh, use some help with. You see, my visceral hugeness and perfect health has been causing a ter totally terrible rift in my most important relationship in my life. That's right. I'm talking about my bird, who is my best bro in the entire galaxy. <laughs> oh, I fucking love this guy. Oh, your bird. Best bros forever. Yeah, see Tiny Terrence here? He just can't seem to bulk up. Maybe on account of his name. 
but also because of his love of watching television and complaining on the internet, instead of complaining at the gym like me. I've tried to help little Terry here beef up so he can roll with my impossibly huge crew, <laughs> but he just hasn't reached his full bird potential. Now, I can't stand to force my favorite broski to literally and figuratively live in my enormous shadow another day. So what do you say, Brosamina? Can you do me a solid and make him more solid? <laughs> uh, fortify your bod to get with the squad. Flappy bird. Uh, sure, let's play. I don't know how we're gonna get him any more beefier. Oh, man. Click to make him flap his mighty wings. Collect healthy foods and proteins to make him strong. And avoid the exercise equipment. It hurts. Alright, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna bulk him up. Alright, bro, you can do this. Flex those wings. Oh, God. Ooh. Ooh, protein. Yeah. I'll take some of that. <gasps> ah, banana potassium. I think we're going for healthy foods, so... Yes. We're getting real swole. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, this is kind of disturbing. <laughs> uh, keep it going, Terrence is into it. No. Uh, no. <gasps> oh no! Wait, what? What did I hit? Oh, I hit the bottom. I get ya. Alright, we're still getting swell. My true strength is emotional maturity. Oh damn, he's real beefy. This is just an expression of my larger commitment to self-care. Oh god. Round three, it's getting real fast now. What the hell is that? I can't see a thing. Oh no. Oh no. Terrence. Ah, uh, we were so close. We'll try that again. Oh man. That was that was totally not fair. I just gotta be real fast this time. I wish it was this easy in real life. All you gotta eat. All you gotta do is eat. It doesn't look like hitting the floor or ceiling uh, loses us any points or lives, so that's good. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, it's real fast now. Terrence, you can do this. No! I don't think it's worth it at this point. <laughs> I'm really bad at this. 
Well, I mean, I got, I got most of the way there. <sighs> okay. Uh, we'll do one more time. If that doesn't work, we'll pass. Gonna start eating containers away, whole containers away, meat. That's how you do it, that's how you get swole. Like Terrence here. Oh no. See. See what we can do here. Just wish that arm would get out of the way. Ooh, you're so small. Just one more. No. Yes. Holy moly, that's his final form. <laughs> Terry, bro, I'm so proud of you. Oh my god. <laughs> Thirds for a bra. Yeah. Oh jeez. <laughs> I'm flexing my eye sockets as hard as I can to keep the tears from flowing, but it's only barely working. <laughs> I guess what I really need to bulk up is my ability to deal with positive emotions. And also my calves, so I stop falling over from my ballast like core. Uh, about the event tonight, well, it doesn't have a way in, I can tell you that. Don't worry, though. I'm bringing my own scale. And I've only been eating protein bars and dehydrated iceberg lettuce and prep. Gross! <laughs> I gotta look my best for my little bro. Thanks again for helping me out and Terry here, bro Livia. Every time we're popping a particularly gnarly squat, we'll make sure to think of you. Cute <laughs> and kind of weird. Oh, who's this? Who's this lady taking selfies? Tin Lizzie. Um, hello. Do you mind stepping approximately three to seven steps to the right? You're blocking the sun, and the luminous scales highlighter I applied is not living up to its customer review section. I've been out here all day with my new phone trying to get the perfect shot, but I just can't seem to look effortless enough. This one here, I totally have an expression, which is a super no-no in selfie town. I need to look just the right amount of disaffected with just the right amount of lip gloss. This glass won't pay for itself after all. <laughs> you know, because I pay for it. Me. Like, I buy it. <laughs> okay. Uh, who are you? I'm Lizzie, but I've been trying to get every uh, trying to get everyone to start calling me Elizabethary. <laughs> Sadly, much like my attempts to be an influencer, it doesn't seem to be happening. Sp <laughs> oh man! Speaking of, I'm promoting fizzy fruit lacroc this week on my social medias. Would you like to try some? Oh, I love the. Love the flavor of nothing. It's soda water that a fruit farmer thought about in passing, <laughs> giving it just enough fruity essence to confuse the palate. Fizzy fruit lacroc, a consideration of strawberry. 
Oh, yeah, that's exactly what it tastes like. <laughs> uh, now, do you know Pat? Tin Lizzie? Huh? Pat? You mean Joni's cousin Pat? Oh my god, Pat is hilarious. Last year, when I spent the holidays with Joni's family, Pat got so punked on eggnog. He thought the Christmas tree was a hired assassin and ran face first into a Santa themed nutcracker display to escape. It took us two hours to get all the walnut shells out of his ears and to get him to stop wearing the beard as a disguise. <laughs> He's kind of a paranoid guy. Totally nice though. Love that bada bandana. <laughs> Cute. Is this. Is this Joni's girlfriend? Uh, the event? I don't know. Are you here spying for Pat? He's not supposed to know anything about this, you feel me? I didn't even post about it on Snoopbook, or Picturegram, or my live journal, or my dead journal. <laughs> I didn't even write it down in my bullet journal just to be extra safe. Plus, then I save on bullets. Uh, what's this game about? We're trying to save Pat, who, uh, apparently, his family is trying to uh, put him out, if you know what I mean. Trying to get him with, to sleep with the fishes. He's apparently squealed about something, and, uh, he's in big trouble. <laughs> or so he thinks. Anyway, uh, we're just gonna talk to his family, see if we can, uh, get all the info if we can. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Try to save Pat's butt. And that's pretty much it. Well, maybe if you could help me out, I could give you just a little info, though. You know, a little you stand my account and I stand yours. See, even though I'm totally a super tech-savvy, super popular picturegram user with over seven followers that aren't blood-related to me, I still am having some trouble with my new phone. I tried to import my photos and they got all dinked up. I can't post dinked photos. And what will my followers do if they were denied the knowledge of the, their parasocial BFF Lizzie's most recent vegan cafe exploits? Right, that's why. Hashtag, give peas a chance. So, will you help me fix my pics? <laughs> okay. Uh, assemble the pics to help her get clicks. Unmix the pics. Let's do it. It's a little puzzle game. I'll play. Photos are decided to assemble a complete photo to win the round. Great. <laughs> we'll do it. Yes, thank you. We should totally should get a selfie of this moment. Hold on. Let me get my stick out of its Swarovski studded holster. God. Oh, no. Okay. Let's go with this. That's easy enough, right? Alright, so when it gets... No, that's not what I wanted. Alright, uh, it doesn't matter now. Hey, this isn't right at all. Can you try a little harder, please? Wow, so rude. Okay, we'll, tr we'll try. Alright, how's that? Hmm? This was like the fanciest bug I've ever eaten. I even need the flour, though I'm pretty sure it may have been a plastic garnish. <laughs> Come to think of it, the bug may have been plastic too. Huh. Was this this just a display? <laughs> oh no. Okay. Oof. Oh, it's Joni. Alright. Oh, it's a little fast. Alright. We'll get to the sand castle. And then at the very bottom. No, that's not right. Oh, man. I thought I got it. Yeah, terrible. Let's do it again. Wait a minute. Uh, that might be easier, actually. You got a photo of your house plants, like any social media influencer would have. Hmm? Oh, no. 
It doesn't matter. Alright, fine. I think this is our last chance. Ah, goes by a little fast. There we go. Yes, this one is so aesthetic. Huh? No, that's not my room. <laughs> I just climbed in the open window. <laughs> if you don't want people taking pics of your perfectly chic apartment through breaking and entering, don't live on the first floor, you dingus. <laughs> oh no. Uh, this is gonna be a little faster, huh? <sighs> okay. That's fine. Everything's fine. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right. Which one is that? <laughs> yes, got it. Oh my god, this was last Halloween. We won best couples costume. Oh, they are girlfriends. I'm allergic to peanuts, but don't worry. It wasn't real peanut butter. I brought my happy pan though. You know, just in case. <laughs> Uploading and posted. Thank you so much. I think people are really gonna like these ones. Especially these cute candids of Joni. Aw, cute. <laughs> we got it. We got the badge. Oh, jeez. How come it's like when I take candidates of my significant gator? They're cute and perfect. But when Joni takes them of me, they're like this. Hashtag relatable relationship. <laughs> uh, that's a picture of me. Oh, yeah, about the event. Well, like, don't tell Pat, but I totally did the playlist for it. I think he's going to be super surprised. But, like, not as surprised at the time he opened the closet and a coat fell on him, causing him to projectile vomit several liters of cranberry sauce. <laughs> Content warnings, bodily fluids, Thanksgiving. Thanks again for all your help, stranger. Make sure to like and subscribe. Hey, that's my line. <laughs> Aww. That was a really wholesome one. Hmm. Alright, uh, did we talk to this guy? That cloud looks like a duck. JP. Okay. Uh, how about this far away? Skids Valentino. Hi. Wanna, um, hear something neat? Hi. Did you know, um, did, did you know this gazebo here in, in Haunted by, um, like, a hundred million ghosts? Uh-huh, uh, 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 it's true. My cousin Giovanni told me so. That's why I'm playing over here. You know, just in case I can meet one, um, so we can be best friends. Or be friends. <laughs> It'd be nice to have a ghost pal instead of being ghosted by pals. Aw. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, buddy. Who are you again? I'm Skids, but my mom usually calls me the other one. Or, who left this <laughs> Oh no! I'm sorry, Skids. <laughs> Sometimes Bonnie Milligan calls me Squids at recess. My teacher says it's just because she likes me. But I think it's because I sometimes smell a little fishy since my bedroom is the spare utility freezer on the back porch. Oh, Skids. Skids, no. There's a lot of fish in the freezer. <laughs> I'm sorry, Skids. Do you know Pat? I think Pat's my cousin. Like the cousin that comes after cousin? Your second cousin? Like the sequel to cousin. Second cousin. I like Pat. He shares his meatballs with me and always plays fun games. Like this one time we ran, both ran in circles to see who could do it the most. Pat won and only threw up a little. 
He's so cool. Uh, what do you know about the event, huh? I'm so, so excited because I'll get to see Pat and Giovanni. But I'm not supposed to talk about it because it's a surprise. Alright. You got a game we can play? I might talk about it a little if you play games with me, though. Wanna play hide and seek? I've been practicing. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let the kid win or you'll see him again. Hide and sheesh. Uh, so we have to let him win. Uh, wait for him to hide, it, then help him win. Cute. I'm gonna hide now. Aww. Uh, okay. Uh, ready or not, I'm hidden. Okay. <laughs> wait, no! Uh, I didn't mean to click on the guy. I thought he, I was gonna talk to him. Ah, oh, shucks. Next time I'll have to hide in a better, more secrety place. One more? Alright, fine. <laughs> Slow giggles. Oh no, I can't find you. <laughs> I hid so good. You looked everywhere except for where I was. One more, one more. <laughs> what is going on? Alright. Oh no. <laughs> Where could he be? Where is this kid? <laughs> I really like how he drew a recreation of the skyline. That's so cute. Alright, one more time. <laughs> oh, that's, that's just so precious. I'm a better hider every time I practice. Thanks for playing with me. What a cute kid. And we got a badge. I, I had a lot of fun. Maybe tonight at the event we can play together again. Alright. Oh jeez. It's a surprise, but Giovanni told me there might be a big cake. I haven't had cake since the last time my mom remembered my birthday. Which was... <sighs> well, anyway, thanks again. Come play with me anytime. <laughs> Skids, I love you. So sorry. Oh, no. <laughs> no one notices him. Now we got a puzzle piece. 4 out of 48. Alright. I wonder what we look like. We gotta be a cool getter. We got these, uh... Uh... Sleeve... I forgot what those are called. Cuffs. We got these cool... Cool looking cuffs. We got some Altoids. Mint condition. A dagger. What the... Uh, okay. Oh, there's a lot more here. Alright. Hero. I was having an emergency, but I got pulled in by Mandolin and Mandy's siren song, as usual. I love listening to him play, and when he tells me to stop sitting so close and rhyming couplets. <laughs> what a guy. <laughs> Cute. Oh, it's, it's the guy from the intro. Oh. Uh, whoops, I didn't mean to do that, I'm sorry. Mandy. Put a coin into my hat. The song I play is sweet, and if you don't agree with that, I do not give receipts. Okay. Alright, we'll put a coin in there. Oh, who's this Tad Gator? Two-Ton Tony. Hey, kiddo. How are you doing today? Me? Any day above the ground, right? <laughs> Just a little mortality joke for you. Since I can only relate to my subconscious fears through deflection. <laughs> oh, no. Hi, deflection. I'm Dad. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm... 
that I'm doing it. Some days, though, are better than others, and today is one of the better days. <sighs> oh, man. You see this big guy here, right here? This sweet piece of metal is the Grill Maestro 300X, the undisputed king of finest grilling technology man has ever known. Yep, can't wait to fire this baby up and do some proper firing. Uh, now all I gotta do is figure out how to start it. Uh, and cook with it. <laughs> and hopefully stop it before the rising flames consume us all. <laughs> oh man, all dads know how to do is nap and not process their emotions correctly. My students call me Mr. Mom Jeans behind my back, but you can call me Tony. <laughs> Tell you the truth though, you can call me whatever you want, so long as you don't call me late for dinner. <laughs> I've punished my internal organs with intense meats and radioactive food colors for several decades. My best years are behind me. Oh, no. Chair Bear. Hey, buddy. Glad you could hop on. How are you doing today? You're doing well. Been a while since I've been in the stream. Yeah, a long time no see. Well, it's good to see you. Alright, do you know Pat? Of course I know Pat. That's one of my boys. The smaller one of them, that wears a hat. He's a good kid, but a little skittish. Bit of a hair trigger on him. Between you and me, I think that bun could have used a little more time in the oven. <laughs> I convey affection through heartless critique. I learned it from my father. Oh, hi my father, I'm dad. <laughs> oh no, this is so sad. Uh, the event, huh? Not sure how much I could tell you about that. Unless you're talking about my wife stopping her yammering. Now that, there's an event I'd like to see. <laughs> well, actually, I love her very much and deeply appreciate the mutual respect and affection that is be present between us. Sorry. I only know how to communicate in relationships through dated humor that stems from the sexism present in sitcoms. Maybe I should start reading those square things. With the paper? Huh. Books. <laughs> oh, that's a dad, all right. Anywho, you seem like a gator that knows their way around a grill. Let's say, hypothetically, that I needed a little bit of help getting this beautiful machine going. I know my lips get a little looser when I hear that fine sizzle of meat being cooked to dadly perfection. So maybe you can lend me a hand, kiddo? Alright, been swell? I've been doing good. Glad you're doing well. Uh, Manic Pixie Dream Grill. <laughs> Save the Grill Master from different disasters. Let's do it. Oh man. Uh, problems keep spawning on this terrible grill. Hold the correct tool over a problem for two seconds to fix it. Watch out for special problems and obstacles. All right. Oh, wait. Uh, okay, we're gonna hold over two seconds to fix the problem. What is this? What's the bucket for? Oh, no. Okay. Uh, oh, it's the, this thing? Oh no! Uh, what's going on here? Ooh! Oh no! Oh, this ain't good. Okay. We doing it? No, this is still wrong. Oh, okay. I didn't look- I didn't pay attention last time. So if it sparks, 
You put the heat gun or whatever that thing is. If there's smoke, you put the fan on. And if there's a fire, fire extinguisher. Okay, I think we're getting the hang of this. I'm gonna turn up the gas a bit, see if we can really get cooking. Okay, resets. Good, good, good. Wait. Wait. Uh. Oh man, wake up! Wake up! Get out of here, Dad! Oh no, he's on fire! Okay, uh, fan? What's going on here? Oh no! Okay. <laughs> nice. You, I mean, we're doing great. Just a little more and I think we'll have this thing at 10. Oh no. Oh no, what the? Oh my things, get out of here. Okay. Oh, that's on fire. Oh, get out of here, Dad. I can't see a thing. Ooh, that's not good. Okay. Uh, he needs a fan. Right? Nah, he's fine. Yeah, nice, we did it. Alright. Amazing. Ain't she a beaut? Totally not terrifying at all with the sheer amount of things going on. Or the little man in overalls living inside it. Extremely normal. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Deflection. Thanks for helping me out today, Takedo. About the event. I can't say too much, but I gotta brag about the balloons I got for it. My boy Pat just loves those colorful sacks of air. Probably why he loves his old man here so much, too. <laughs> My body is aging rapidly. Nobody can stop the forward cycle of time. Oh, jeez. See you tonight, kiddo. Age sharp. Don't be late. Uh, hey, and your friendly city guide here. So I was wondering, have you been finding any puzzle pieces around? I have. I thought so. You can find a lot of fun things you might not expect in the city by clicking around. Uh, puzzle pieces, secret baubles, look at interestingly shaped sewer rats. It's a real menagerie. Menagerie? Maybe if you find enough pieces, you'll be able to f do something good with them. Like unlock something. Or make a small blanket for his family of chilly squirrels. The world is bright, so have fun, lots of fun looking around. Alright, we'll do. Uh, let's look around here. Oh, who's this guy? He's looking sad. Oh, it's Giovanni. Huh? I'm not doing anything. I mean, well, that's not exactly true. I'm standing here. I'm existing. Somewhat. Literally nothing. Just standing here. My snoot is running from ragweed allergies. I'm not doing anything that has to do with the soda machine, though. Nope. Nothing at all. Huh. Uh, who are you? I'm Giovanni. Just, uh, the totally cool gator teen who hangs out at the park. By himself. With the soda. Huh. You know Pat, right? Pat? You mean my cousin Pat? Yeah, he's great. We used to play a lot more when I was a little kid, but I still think he's pretty cool. Sometimes he'll meet me at the mall food court after school, and we get nachos. I'm lactose intolerant, so my dad doesn't let me have that stuff usually because it makes me blow chunks. Oh! <laughs> but Pat doesn't mind holding my hoodie back when I spew. He's a total bro. <laughs> okay. The event? Oh, uh... What? Eve. 
bed. Uh, okay, okay, you got me. I'll spill my guts. When I said I wasn't doing anything earlier, it was sort of, maybe, definitely a lie. You see that soda machine right there? The truth is, I'm a bit of a cola connoisseur, and this fountain in particular is a beaut. All the best, most classic fa flavors. Soda's so rare, they stopped making them in the 90s. It's like time stopped here, letting me pickle my pubescent organs in carbonated bliss. Uh, gross. <laughs> Once, at this very spot, I mixed a soda combo so great that the last of my baby teeth disintegrated with a slight whistle noise. Sadly, no matter how I try, I can't seem to get the flavor right again. So I was kind of hoping you'd help me rediscover it. Maybe if we figure it out, I can help you with something. Oh man, I, I, I loved mixing the drinks at the soda fountain. Uh, like my good old invention, fruit beer. A uh, mix of the drinks and see what he thinks. Hooked on tonics. Let's play. Uh, try to follow Giovanni's soda instructions. Move the cup to the right to see the recipes. Uh, then up to the fountain side of flavor. Uh, when you're ready, click on Giovanni to start his taste test. Okay. You have my recipe cards. Those are the sodas I've already invented. But how can I make something totally new and different? I don't know, it feels like a lot of pressure. I guess, um... Can I taste the sick lemon? I can't remember what it's like. Okay. Here you go. Aw, cute. Ugh, that's right. I remember sick lemon now. I hate this soda. It tastes like chemicals. I need to wash that taste out of my mouth. Give me the Dr. Soda. Okay. Uh, we got Dentist's Ira, Sick Lemon, the Fruit One, Cold Cola, Dr. Soda, and Bug Cream. Taste this. I think I found my soulmate. <laughs> oh, are you gonna draw fan art? Mm, yes, the sweet sugary rush of Dr. Soda. Dr. Soda is the best, most delicious, most addictive soda of all time. It's my very favorite. Maybe I can take inspiration from one of my old recipes. Can you look at my recipe card and give me a cool guy juice? Okay. Uh, cool guy juice. We got a cold cola and a fruit one. Wait a minute, that's just ice. <laughs> All right, here you go. Inspiring flavor. Yes, this is masterful. You're a genius, Past Giovanni. Let's use cool guy juice as a base. But how do I make cool guy juice even better? That's the question. Oh no, I'm cracking under the pressure of my own success. <laughs> uh, let's try mixing cool guy juice and face melter together, maybe. Does that sound good? Alright, uh, cool guy juice, cold cola, and fruit one. And face melter. Dentist's Ira plus sick lemon. Okay, let's try it. I would guess the sick lemon would be bad, right? Here you go. <laughs> it is really cute. Ah, it's okay, but I expected it to be better. Uh, take this and let me think. What's wrong with this soda mix? Maybe I'm just bad at mixing sodas. I guess it could be a weird flavor, though. This face melter had the best bad flavor in it, the one from earlier. Combine the two recipes again, this time take out the flavor I didn't like. All right. Yeah, the sick lemon, he didn't like that. Here, take this. That's perfect. You totally nailed it. 
In your honor, I'm gonna name this drink Cola Miner's Daughter. <laughs> Thanks for your help. Cute. Super cute. Alright, alright, let's see. Wow, your soda mixing skills are truly a force to be reckoned with. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I knew when I saw you. There's a sticky, be pimpled teen inside you, just waiting to be lured out to make the perfect sugary concoction. I've been preparing an extra special beverage for Pat. It's gonna be killer. Uh... <laughs> killer awesome, I mean. <laughs> Not like it'll kill him. He does get startled pretty easy, though. Sudden moves tend to make him dive action movie style out of plague glass windows. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Thanks for again for your help, Flavor Master. See you tonight. It's so cute. Oh, what's this? Hello, hello. You're pal the city aficionado here. I just wanted to make sure you know about the cool local place called Nanaru's Antiques. I know what you're thinking. Antiques are for grandmas. And you're right. The whole shop is run by a grandma. Well, a nana. Nanaru. There's a great local legend about the place, that it's super haunted by, like, five billion ghosts. Oh. Okay. What's really haunting, though, is the prices. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Just a little shopping humor from me to you. I'm not really rolling on the floor. Ah. Anyway, Nanaru is as much of a card shark as she is a deal shark, so be careful. But if you have time, Definitely check out her colorful shop. It's tons of fun. All right, all right, all right. I'll, I'll keep that in mind. Nanaru's Antiques, huh? All right. Let's talk to the cashier here. Jules. Welcome to an emergency where you're on your city with urgency. Today's specials are 12 cc's of sliders which come with chips and saline. You can add a side salad if you meet your deductible. <laughs> oh, wow, okay. Uh, 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 where else can we go? What time is it, actually? Hmm. It's two. I still think we have some time. Uh. Chair. Yes. Yes. What's up? Steal money from the fountain? Can I do that? Huh. I don't know if I can. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's... Anything here. Music's kind of calming. It's it's Mandy here, playing us the nice tunes. Uh, nah, I can't click on the fountain. That's all right. Should we check out something else? Welcome to my beautiful city, Mayor Wibbly Finn. <laughs> oh man, he looks like he's on his deathbed. Uh, fun facts. Booming bug economy. See the Alligator New York City Alligator Opera presents Alligator Pagliacci. And free hot dogs on Fridays. Is that so? Alright, uh... We could always visit the... I don't know. Where do you guys think we should go next? We're currently at the Alligator Memorial Park, and I don't think we've checked out the other places, unless we've been to downtown. The unsavory part of town. Hmm. Unsavory. Why does everyone want unsavory? <laughs> well, let's check it out. 
Ugh. Oh man. <laughs> what a dork. Uh, hey buddy, you're a good old guide here. I just wanted to warn you, in a city so big, there are bound to be parts of town that are a little seedy. I'm talking seedy tough guys. Seedy tough guys who eat the seeds of things without spitting them out onto a napkin politely. So just be careful. Don't go clicking around in back alleys or anything. You never know what you might find. Okay. Who's this guy? He's just meditating. Hey man, you got any change or novelty tie-dye apparel? Wow, Star Child, I can like feel your energy from over here. Oh, you got it's just surrounded in crystals. Aiden, I'd say it's what's harshing my whole thing right now. Oh, are my vibes that rank? But the truth is, I free cycled some really gnarly bagels for lunch today out of the dumpster behind the furniture store. My mellow has been thoroughly pre harshed. Huh? Why would there be bagels in the dumpster of a furniture store? Oh, throw pillows. Bummer. Listen, who among us hasn't woken up at noon in a van under a blanket felted equally from stranger lint and candy wrappers? It's no wonder I got into the wrong dumpster. If anything, it's fate. <laughs> right, who are you, Aiden? I'm Aiden. It's totally chill to meet you .com .org. <laughs> I sort of knew someone would seek me out today. I'm like a bit of a clairvoyant, according to some subforums I visit online. Plus, I own a somewhat unsettling amount of powerful crystals. Their potent energies course through me into my inner core. Which is great, since I spent the last of my dosh on some suspiciously expensive crystals. And my inner core is super starving, man. <laughs> Uh, do you by chance know Pat? Did you say Pat? He's a pretty cool guy, kinda dresses like a preschooler though, if I'm being realsies. My little sister Lizzie is dating his cousin, so I guess you could say we're kind of like family. Uh, Lizzie, the, the influencer. Yeah. You can say anything to strangers, really. No one can stop you. Alright, and do you know anything about the event? Tonight? Oh, dude, I'm sorry. I really can't tell you much. I've been sworn to secrecy. Alright, you got you got a game I can play? I could actually, like, probably tell you a few things if you do me a solid first. You see, those suspiciously expensive crystals I mentioned earlier? Well, those little mamas were also suspiciously powerful. From just three nights of holding them, even when I had to get up to do pee, I feel mystically charged enough to access my innermost self. But in my tireless questing through the crystal concentration arts, I just don't have the time to shower or dust my pure miniatures. Besides, bathing is way for the man to keep us is a way for the man to keep us down. You should be sliding across the floor in an oil slick of your own creation, like nature intended. Gross. My aromatic scent keeps away a lot of unwanted company, like solicitors and my father. <laughs> but it invited others. I'm talking about flies. These little buzzing buzzkills keep harshing my mellow. They're making it impossible for me to concentrate on my inner light to do it in a right, if you know what I mean. If you could just swat them away from me while I'm getting my meditation on, I'd be happy to do you a solid in return. So will you be my spotter swatter? <laughs> okay. Oh man. Alright. Slap a fly from an icky guy. Meditation infestation. Let's do it. Uh, click on flies and hornets to attack them with the fly swatter. Hornets take extra hits. Don't swat butterflies or Aiden. Yeah, we don't want to ruin his vibes. Alright, see dad, I do have friends. 
<laughs> no. Get out of here. Oh shit, I'm sorry, Aiden. Wait, I didn't even slap you. Alright, these mystical power, he's... He's really charging up here. Oh, fuck. It's happening. The subforms were right. I have to keep going. Okay, I'm just gonna wait for them to... Oh no, not the hornets. Oh, why there's so many? <laughs> oh man, I'm so overwhelmed. I'm starting to feel the cosmos and pick up Wi-Fi. What? <laughs> Oh, man. What's going on? Keep going. I'm almost there. Okay. Get out of here, flies. Oh, no. Not the hornets. Oh, God. Oh, nice. He's fucking reached Nirvana. <laughs> I am a good swatter. Thank you very much. Hello, my star child. Through crystal channeling and staying modestly hydrated like advised on social medias, I have been able to reach my most powerful form. What the fuck? Oh, jeez. I'm still the Aiden you've known and adored for so, so long, but a new, more powerful Aiden. A Paiden, as it were. Like how I haven't been paid in weeks. I'm so hungry. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. I don't feel the human desire for food in my new astral mode. Hey, did you just hear an ice cream truck? Oh, no reason, I just like the song the truck plays. It's a real bop. No, I'm not crying. I can now tell you a bit about the event now, since I'm a being of pure energy and knowledge good in form. <laughs> What's going on? But also a being that's like, extremely good at keeping secrets, man. What little I can tell you is, it concerns Pat for a certain reason. That's really all I can say. I don't want Lizzie to get too mad at me for spilling the beans. She's got angry little sister hands. Even beings of pure peaceful energy are adverse to tiny sister punches. Thank you again for your spiritual guidance. What you have done here today will not soon be forgotten. At least not for the 45 minutes of short-term memory I have. <laughs> hey, did you hear an ice cream truck? Oh no. Alright. <laughs> I just realized it says a very adult bar. Oh, it's very adult. Oh yeah, he just became God. Okay, who are these two gators chatting? Prince Valentino. I say, you there, vagrant. Brother, I don't think they're a vagrant. They've got that suit on. Perhaps a hobo king? Hmm, you may be right, sister. You there, hobo king. Come here a moment. <laughs> Honestly, brother, what are we even doing in this filthy part of town? <laughs> Princess Valentino. Even breathing the outside of this seedy watering hole is making my scales lose their highly regarded luster. I agree, sister, but you know as well as I that we had to find an unbiased bonehead for our beneficiary. So anyone at the estate was out. Besides... You know how wary I grow of literally everyone we know in the whole world. Shall we talk to this stranger with the briefcase, then? Yes, yes, as long as it's not someone that gives me the dreadful horror of being known. Okay. Uh, who are you guys? Who are, who are these fucky characters? Brother, there's nobody doesn't seem to be aware of who we are. Indeed, sister. 
Perhaps that pinstripe style they've spent the last 30 or so years locked in a storage closet with their fingers in their ears. I'm being fucking attacked. And there are other fingers in their eyes. And fingers yet still in their nose. <laughs> Obviously, since I released that perfume that, this year. Obviously. I am Princess Valentino, heir to the Valentino fortune. And this is my brother, Prince Valentino. He's also there, since we're twins. <laughs> I'm the evil twin. They couldn't test for that gene, and you know it, Prince. <laughs> Cute, okay. You guys know Pat. Pat? Uh, why, well, he's our second cousin. I can do voices. That's like a cousin, but thankfully a little more removed from your gene pool. The amount of DNA shared between us is blessedly on the shallow side, much like your personality, sister. <laughs> oh, Prince. You're such a cut-up. Much like how I cut up your invitation to the Met Gala this year and fed it to the cat. What? <laughs> but the theme this year was the Monopoly mascot. And you know Mittens the Third is on a strict diet for failing kidney kidneys. Uh, you guys know about the event? Well, now you're going to be have uh, you're going to have to be more specific. I attend a lot of events, you know, balls, galas, exhibitions, Prince's unfortunate performance art shows. If you are speaking of last week when I walked the runway for Gil's fashion fishery rubber plants from moist alligators, <laughs> what? I'll have you know I got a write-up in a magazine spread for highlights for children. Anyway, if you're talking about tonight, we have no qualms. Spilling the whole secret to you. That is if you'll only you do us the smallest of favors. And what's that? What's that? You see, our beloved daddy passed away just recently from poison-related complications. You know, the natural way. <laughs> oh, God. We're splitting up our shared inheritance, but we could really use a mediator. And someone to protect my beautiful face from my dear sister's punches. It's true, I punch super duper hard. If only we had some help dividing up Daddy's precious possessions. I'm sure we could tell you the information you seek. So, will you help us, or do you have hobo king duties to attend to? <laughs> Alright. Uh, split the perks between these jerks. Divine it, twin inheritance. I fucking love these titles. Let's do it. Uh, assign an item to each of the Valentino Trunes. You can't leave until both twins are happy, so pay attention to the indicator bar. Okay. I think this is the last minigame we play uh, before I uh, end the stream here. It is getting late for me. Uh, well, let's get on with this. Daddy's not getting any more alive. I'm already bored. Okay. Uh, the Inheritance Minx Thol? I simply couldn't. My conscience wouldn't allow it. It clashes terribly with everything I own, and I'd be up all night worrying about it. Alright, we'll give her that. Uh, I don't know. Does he want the armor? Hmm, shiny, damaged, and empty. Well, it wouldn't totally be out of place with me, I suppose. Oh, damn. I guess she doesn't like the mink. <laughs> Ooh, cozy. Just the kind of thing I like. Woman made through the suffering of another. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Mm. You want the hat? Oh, she likes the hat. Father's secret society hat. I'd wonder if it'd been lost after the SWAT raids. Oh, jeez. Uh, you want wine? This really brings back memories. Remember when we walled up tipsy cousin Cleo in the wine cellar after luring her with the promise of an even finer vintage? Uh, a fucking cask of... Uh, Amontillado? Oh, how we laughed. Alright, well maybe not the wine. Actually... 
Oh, God. Okay, we gotta make sure of that. I don't know, do you, do you want a painting? Yeah, alright. I uh, look great, placed delicately behind for my upcoming photo on the cover of Vanity Flora Flair. Fashion magazine for mean lady alligators. Uh, do you want a parrot? Yeah, alright. Oh, they're about tight now. Bernard. I spent hours training him to eat $50 bills in front of our governess as she cried. Oh, God. Sweet childhood memories. God, these two are awful. Uh, alright. Cask of Alligator Auto. Perfect. Uh, let's see. Uh, why don't you take the sports car? Well, my several phones could use a car. <laughs> okay. Uh, do you want the blade? I guess not. How about a vinyl? Uh, he likes it a little bit. Uh... Photo? Uh, he doesn't like it, so... Well, I'll give him the photo. <laughs> Alright, how about... Okay, who wants the ashes? Yeah, there we go. Sack of cash, okay. We're getting there. Money sacks, diamond throwing parties, PJs made of two parts endangered tiger, one part Great Barrier Reef. Daddy knew how to live. Oh god. Uh, crystal Orb. Uh, she likes it a lot. I think that's it. Now we have to distribute it correctly. Rather gauche, don't you think? Eyeballs are so last season, which is why I'm having mine removed next month. <laughs> okay, well, he's happy. Uh, now we gotta give her something. The blade. Yes! Alright, one more thing. Uh, not the wine. Oh god, they forgot about Cousin Cleo. Okay. Uh, yeah? No. Come on, just one more thing. Okay. Okay, maybe we'll give the ashes to her. And then you can have... Not the blade. Uh, you want the parrot? Maybe the crystal orb. Alright, there's one more thing, I think. Oh, not the painting. Oh, that's so hard. Uh, oh, it's so close. Okay. Not that. Here's the wine. Keep the wine. Oh, God. Okay. Yes! There we go. We did it. We did it. So the rest of Skid's family. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. That's all of Daddy's things, and I feel quite pleased with my whole. And me as well. Well, I am such a good mood, I'm almost feeling feelings again. Seriously, brother? How pedestrian. <laughs> I know. Please don't tell any of the servants. They'll start asking me for silver dollars or whatever they eat these days. I guess we should thank you, Pinstripes, and tell you what, uh, what you want to know about the event. But, uh, but we won't. Your reward is our smiling snoots. Now get out of our car before we ring the police. 
Those bastards. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. Those snooty bastards. All right. You think the twins near the third? Wink, wink. What are you trying to say, Amber? <laughs> you want in on that? By all means. Alright, so. Yeah, I'll leave it here. I'll leave the stream here. And uh, that was pretty fun. I really like these mini games. Totally. Uh, totally fun to play. I think there's multiple endings, so. There's some replay value there. And the characters are really great. The writing in this is. Uh, really amazing. And all the anim animations, they're so well done and smooth. Like, it looks like an actual cartoon. Well, <laughs> it looks like a, a, a triple A. I don't know how to, I don't know how you'd say that. It looks like a TV cartoon. You know what I mean? It's very, very finished. Yeah, that was very fun. Glad you guys enjoyed it. Uh, so yeah, I'll be playing this very soon, again. And next time, we'll check out the rest of uh, the unsavory part of town. So yeah. Alright. Oh jeez. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty fun and wholesome. I'm glad I got to play that. Uh... <sighs> yeah, we accomplished a lot today. And we adopted Skids. Skids Valentino. We're gonna take care of him now. Yeah, uh, thank you for watching. Thanks for hopping on the stream. Uh, I really enjoyed that, and I really appreciate you guys being here to enjoy it. Yeah. But, uh, I'll be able to stream soon this week. Uh, my weekend will be pretty busy, so I don't think I'll be able to fit any streams in there, but we'll see. Got frustrated by a fountain. That's all right. It's all right. I think we found a, a puzzle piece in there, so it's not a total loss. At least we got something from it. Yeah. Yeah. I really like that. It's a very fun, wholesome experience. It's very well made. So yeah, again, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you haven't already, you can join the Discord. The link is in the description below. If you do want to check this game out yourself, the uh, link is also in the description. And make sure to follow me on Twitter and you'll find that in the box below too. So yeah, uh, don't forget to take care of yourselves, and I hope you guys have a good night. I'll see you next time. Bye.